Good day viewers, today I will show you how to work the Red Dragon M601 RGB mouse software. You can download it on Red Dragon Zone. Once you download and install the software, it will look something like this. You have different DPI settings on the mouse you can use. For me it's currently set to 2400 as the max. But the maximum amount the mouse can do is 7200, which is quite high, but quite nice for gaming. You have different buttons on the mouse, different programmable buttons, six of them to be precise. You can set each button to do a different task. For me, button six is the DPI button, which I set to switch the colors of my lighting effects. So instead of coming into the software each time, I can just set it on the mouse itself. If I need a quick and easy way to set the lights for the mouse. On the lighting effects, you have different lighting effects. The default one you will start with is colorful streaming. You can set the speed of the stream and the direction. For steady, it's just a red color. You can set the brightness as well and apply it. The third one is breathing, which is my favorite effect to use. You can set different colors for it to be breathing. And you can set the speed. For tail, it just goes front to back, back to front. It's quite nice if you have that lightning effect. It's almost like a lightning effect. You can also set the speed. Neon cycles through different neon colors. So if you have a neon neon themed gaming setup, you can use this and it will fit in very nicely. You also have colorful steady, which has a lot of different colors in the mouse, but it just stays on one spot the whole time. So if you take out a color and apply it, it will no longer show that specific color on the mouse. For flicker, it flickers between red and blue. You can set the blue off, then it also flickers just red. You can set the blue on and the red off, then it will also just flicker blue. Streaming is just streaming the different colors. Here you on only can set the speed. Wave is also a quite nice one. If you have different colors in your setup, that this will fit very nicely. You can also set the speed. And if you don't like RGB at all, you can just set it to off or none. In this case. So for mouse parameters you can set the mouse sensitivity, the scrolling speed and the double click speed. Mine is set to the defaults at the moment. Polling rate is just the speed between the communication of the mouse and the PC. So the faster the polling rate the faster the speed of the connection between the mouse and the PC. Thank you for watching guys, I hope this helps. Enjoy your day.